To follow this tutorial, you will need to have Duet 2, Mac OS 10.6.7 or greater, and GarageBand 11. Open GarageBand. For the purpose of this tutorial, choose Electric Guitar in the new project window. Next, name your song and save it. You should now see GarageBand open with a single track and a default guitar amp. Click on GarageBand, Preferences, and then Audio MIDI. For audio output, select Duet USB 2.0. You will see a message asking if you want to change the audio driver. Choose Yes. Do the same for audio input. To experience the full audio resolution of Duet, select Advanced, Audio Resolution, and then select Best. Now, close the Preferences window. Make sure that Guitar Track is highlighted. Click on the amp so that you see its controls below. Click Edit. Make sure Input Source is set to Duet USB 2.0. Set Monitor to On. Now, launch Maestro 2 located in the Applications folder. Click on Input and then select the Input Source. Since we created a guitar track in GarageBand, we will choose Instrument and plug a guitar into Duet's quarter-inch instrument input. Duet can control input and output level with a single knob. The four icons on the top panel indicate which input or output source you have selected. We have Instrument selected, so you will see the guitar icon is lit. Now, just plug in your headphones or speakers, adjust your levels, press record in GarageBand's transport control, and begin recording. If you want to record vocals or an acoustic instrument, click on the plus button to add a new track. Choose Real Instrument. Make sure Input Source is set to Duet USB 2.0 and Monitor is set to On. In Maestro, change Source to Mic if you are using a dynamic or ribbon mic. If you are using a condenser microphone, you will also need to click on the 48 button to turn Phantom Power on. Now adjust levels and record.